Today I'll be attempting my hardest Zelda challenge yet using Waikuteru's Randomizer mod, which fires off random effects and enemies the entire time you play. It'll warp you around, it'll set you on fire, it is outrageously difficult, and my goal is to beat nine randomly generated tasks in the open world all in a single life. If I die during this challenge, this video ends. Now beating all nine goals will probably take a few hours, so I let Twitch chat bet on how long I would actually survive. Most people bet under 20 minutes, which is insane. That would be pathetic even for me. So I have to play the best goddamn Zelda of my life. Let's start this off by having the mod choose my nine random goals. He's stalling. You know what? Just because you said he's stalling, we're getting into it. But I won't let you sit here and slander me. Go. I'm not stalling. I'm perfectly happy to end the stream. I'm not stalling. Okay, so it's going to generate nine random goals, and I'm going to try to complete as many of them as I can. Okay, let me write down. <laughs> I'm going to stall. Let me write down the goals so people can see them. I'm going to really take my time. I'm going to read them over a few times, make sure there's no typos. We don't want to rush into this chat. After a few minutes with the mod, we've generated my nine random goals, which are to collect a variety of food and plants, plus to take a picture of a flower and to kill an Igneo Talus, which normally are not super hard. But with this mod, it is extremely deadly. Now we begin. Here we go. I'm going to go to the bathroom. All right, let's jam. Reset the timer. What? Sorry, I can't hear you over all the awesome music. Ooh, snow boots. Look, I'm not stalling. But look at those pants. Some good looking pants, right? All right, here we go. Before you go, shouldn't you make sure everything is spelled right? Yeah, that's true. Okay. Hyrule bass. Raw meat. Hylian shroom. Wait, Hylian shroom. One, two, three Hylian shrooms already. I got to get at least one goal done. Whoa! No, 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 no! Okay, hold on. Lionels can now spawn everywhere. Okay, we gotta look out for Lionels. We have to move to the tower first. Wait, there's a Lionel on the tower. Do you see it? It's right... God damn it. Okay, now Muldugas can spawn. I actually just need to hide right now. So, that mound over there is where I have to go. There is a Lionel on it. I mean, this is like the worst possible combination. I can't go anywhere because if Muldugas sees me, it'll just eat me. And if Lionels see me, they'll shoot me from super far away. Okay, there's two Lionels next, <laughs> next to the tower. Oh, God damn it. The Lionel's right there. <laughs> what do I do? That's the terminal. I have to open the... <laughs> I can't sneak around. He's standing next to it. Shrines are disabled. I can't open it anyway. I'm stalling. Oh, but wait. Ah! Wait, but the shrines are disabled. No! No, I had it. This is a fucking mess. All right, shh. Everybody quiet down. I have to stall until... I literally cannot make progress until the shrines are re-enabled. Okay, shrines are re-enabled. I think we can go. Oh, I'm fucking nuts. And with me activating this first tower, that means I'm guaranteed to live past 20 minutes. I'm the greatest player. Everybody who believed in me just earned a shitload of channel points. Doubter's fucking shaking and vomiting right now. Stalling, 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 stalling. These are holy moly fake stalling. points. It doesn't matter. I am not a grocery store. You cannot spend these on food and milk. And yet you act like I broke into your home and robbed you of the points. As we can all tell by now, Twitch channel has gotten way too invested in fake channel points, and they started trying to buy actual goods and services from me, like milk and ketchup, like I'm a fucking grocery store, but these points are not real. I am not a store. I am very upset with the quality of goods at this store. They're pixel thin. I would like to speak with your manager. Have a complimentary berry. We give it to all of our customers. What am I supposed to do? There's a Lionel right there, literally. Okay, well, got, <laughs> I picked up that milk you wanted, Jet. I haven't eaten in days. I sold my final possessions to keep my family alive. My ex-wife is mocking me. Anyways, I'll take two loaves of bread and some ice cream. <laughs> okay, those are on aisle 13. I have to run behind the tower. We have to go back that way. Is he gone? I think he finally left, dude. I think we're okay? He's just gonna appear right around me, isn't he? Whoa. Ah! No, 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 no! Oh my god. Ah! I have no health. I have to go to zigzags. I don't think Lionels are going to be over here. He's still running after me. Stop whistling. I need to go faster. I'd rather go fast and... Mulduga somewhere! I don't know where. Where's the Lionel? Is Lionel still here? Lionel's over there. But he doesn't see me, I don't think. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Nope, we're going. All right, maybe we make it. All environmental changes are occurring. Holy shit, I made it. Jesus Christ, man. Oh. <sighs> Okay, I have stasis. That's not the correct rune for this. Cool. Now I can do this. Wow. Okay, so we gotta go to the other shrines to get the other powers. Mr. Doug, these points may not seem like real money to you, but to us, the chatters, 
This is very real. We need these points to buy food for our families, <laughs> for rent, and so much more. You really don't. Whoever is selling you this food, I'm just not sure if you can trust them. I think if I just split the gap, I should be fine, but then there's a guardian right there. That guy's real. Yeah, I mean, we just go for it. Okay, I really do not want the Lozolfos to see me. Shit, I whistle ran. That was dumb. Okay, 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 okay. This is completely fine. I'm still going straight. I think I can make it. I cannot make it. That was a terrible idea. This is fine. This is fine. We drop down. We go to the shrine. God damn it. There's so many dudes. <sighs> and with that, I'm at the second shrine. And I'll definitely survive up to 40 minutes now, which means the believers win again. Suck it, doubters. You cowards thought I was going to die right away. No. Now, getting out of here might be hard. What thing do I get? Oh, okay. I could go back to the Magnesis shrine. Are the divorce lawyers horses? Are you selling div horse lawyers on aisle 13? <laughs> Yeah, those are those are next to the hooves. All right, all right, right. There is an enemy in here. I need to focus. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna push a path towards him. Now I just go step on him. Ah! 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 Okay, we'll just hit him. Can I kill him? Oh, okay, he gave me a balloon. Very cool. I thought it was going to fly. Oh. So, for a map perspective, we're going to get to this shrine. I'm going to walk along the edge here. This open field is scary. This is where I died to a Moldugu the last time I did this. I'm going to try to follow along the edge and then get onto this thing. Then we cross the little gap. This is where oh, I'll chop a tree down. I'll cross this, climb up. There's a shrine here. And then once we're up here, we cross the mountains into this place. I don't know how I'll deal with the cold, but we'll figure that out. All right, cool. Let's go. That's one hour. Doubters are shaking and screaming right now. I think I should have died a lot so far, but we're doing great. Hey, Doug. I am in Doug Mart right now. Can you help me find your freshest oxygen tanks? Hey, those are on aisle 13. Cool, we got bombs. Doug, where's aisle 13? It's next to aisle 12. Where's aisle 12? It's next to aisle 13. We're warping back to the fourth shrine, and then we're good. And we got paraglider. Can you tell us what exactly is in aisle 1 through 12? Uh, we have pamphlets for that. They're in aisle 13. Doug. Why is the mart entirely comprised of aisle 13? I've been walking for days. Look, when you have one really good aisle, you don't need any others. Name one thing that's missing from aisle 13. Now, while Twitch chat has been shopping in the Doug Mart, I have been knocking out all four shrines in the Great Plateau. I'm somehow still alive after an hour and a half of this mess, so now we head to the Temple of Time to finish off the Great Plateau. Doug, I looked for my dad in the Milk Island. I didn't see him. Is there anywhere else worth looking? Uh... Have you, have you searched aisle 13? Hey, Doug. Yo. There is a cleanup on aisle 13. Can you send over Biff? <laughs> this is where Biff went. For context, Biff is the beloved janitor that I hired when I played Planet Coaster a while ago, who sucked ass at his job. Just like Channel Points, he is not real. Doug, Biff is still sick from his bloodletting appointment. He <laughs> cannot go on cleanup right now. What do we do? I guess we'll call Twitch. No, not Lionel's. God damn it, dude. I have to get up to the Temple of Time. Wait, can I just climb it here? Okay, I'm just running. I know there's a lizard here. We're just going for it. Ha! Lightning was a little bit scary. The lizard was chasing me. The Lionel was there, but I think we're fucking good, man. We got glider. Doug, I'm lost in aisle 31. Send help. Bring in some help on aisle 31, please. Biff! This wasn't in Biff's job description. Yeah, it was. It was in the fine print. He just didn't notice. Hey, Doug. Biff can't come for cleanup right now. He's striking. He wants to form a union. He'll have to find the union aisle. But Biff sucks so bad at his job, he'll never find it. And now, the Great Plateau is officially done, and I'm still alive, which means it's time to knock out these nine random goals. I'll start by heading towards Hateno Village so I can start getting the camera. The guy who Biff helped in aisle 31 brutally stabbed him. Well, it's part of the job description. Where am I? Now, I tried warping over to the Great Plateau Tower, but forgot that this mod will randomly warp you around the map, and instead I ended up at Hateno Village. Okay, that's awesome, and we just go here now. I mean, this is where I wanted to go. It was gonna take like 30 minutes of running. Hey, Doug, I trust you will pay Biff's medical bills. Right. You stabbed him, right? And I'm <laughs> I'm covering his hospital bills <laughs> is what's going on. I stopped paying attention for just a minute or two, and I feel like I'm behind now. There's a... 
Where's the Mulduga? Where's the Mulduga? I mean, I, I need to get to the shrine. I'm going for the shrine. Wait, is Biff injured in aisle 13 or is health insurance that we can buy is in aisle 13? And do we have options on Biff's copay? Every $3 that you donate for Texas Beach, one penny will go towards Biff's copay. This is like at grocery stores when I ask you, do you want to add one cent for like children on fire or whatever? And... Unfortunately, the mod has disabled shrines right now, so I'm just gonna have to wait here until the effect ends while Twitch chat berates me about my employees. Hey, Doug, where's Biff? I came to warn him to stay out of aisle 13. Biff, get out of there! They want to stab you again, Biff! Only the best for Biff. Thank you. They'll put the the one penny you just donated, like, directly into the stab wound. For Biff, this is my first stream here, and I already have caused a whole plot line concerning the health of your workers. Now I will start a workers' union for free health care for our jobs. You are giving me money to form a union in the grocery store. That doesn't make sense. Biff has died. The 10th of October 2022, it's as a dead? result of his injuries sustained oh, in R13. No. Twitch chat, please offer your condolences to his family during this trying time. But we put like four or five pennies into the stab wound. That didn't that didn't work. I can't hide the truth anymore. Doug hired me to stab Biff. No, oh, no. Where do I pay my membership to join the union? So Biff's stab hole is like a donation bin, and you just go there. That's where the union collects their dues. Okay, shrines are enabled. Doug, we are sacrificing Biff to the union gods and then reviving him so we can sacrifice him again, and we will not stop unless you give us health benefits. Hold on, so you are repeatedly murdering my janitor Biff as a threat for health insurance for him. Right, I want to be clear. You guys seem to have a real love-hate kill relationship with Biff. Okay, here's the plan. I'm going to go to this tower. We're going to go east. I'm going to try to make it to Kakariko Village. Once we get there, we start the quest line. We go back to Hitano Village. We get the camera. Hey, Doug. Marry slash fuck slash kill on Biff. Actually, first I'm going to grab some mushrooms. Sorry, you're asking if I would marry and then fuck and then kill Biff. In that order or a different order? Doug, an engineer has reported that the store may have achieved sentience. The union needs to know if you plan on giving it human rights benefits. You're asking if I'm gonna give health insurance to my grocery store, right? I just, I, I'm starting to get a hey, little Doug, lost on the I lore. want you to know I got married to Biff Stamp. <laughs> okay, can we stop for just a second? I just want to announce that I am getting my seventh mushroom. That is one of the goals. Yes, I'm the greatest Zelda player of all time. That is officially one goal out of nine done. But honestly, this whole challenge is starting to look pretty doable. Most of the other eight goals are just about collecting stuff and I've gotten way better at dodging all the extremely deadly enemies. So now I'll start running to Kakariko Village. I just can't die. Sorry, let's get back into the what's important. You don't even care about Biff. Let's get back to Biff. Sorry to distract from um, from Biff's funeral or marriage or resurrection. I'm not totally clear what's what's been going on with Biff right now. What? That's sick! We're here! <laughs> Holy shit! Okay, I've gotten really, really lucky with the warps. I've warped of the, like, 200 places you could warp. I've warped to Kakariko Village and Hateno Village. Excuse me, sir. Can you please get your employees under control? I am just trying to shop here and all of your employees keep putting coins into your janitor's stab hole and yelling about unions. <laughs> yeah, okay, look, I they have a right to unionize. And they have a right to use the stab hole for the unionization. There's a Mulduga in the house, I think. Well, uh, hopefully I don't die. Here we go. Hey, Doug. I Where just wanted to let you know me and Biff's stab hole are getting a divorce. <laughs> I found out he's cheating on me with Biff behind my back. I mean, I feel like those are those two are a little inseparable. Can I leave? Ah! I can't climb. I need to go to that shrine. Where the hell is the Mulduga? I just don't want to get sniped by it, man. You know what? We're going for it. I don't care. I am in a whistle spread. I don't think Muldugas have ears. No! Okay, hold on. I just died there from Mulduga and lightning, but that shouldn't count. Hear me out. That death was actually Twitch chat's fault. It is their responsibility to warn me if there's danger, which no one was doing except that guy who's just talking about the stab hole. I should get one more try at this challenge completely. New game, I have to start from the very beginning, but the death only counts if Twitch chat actually warns me of danger. If they do that and I die, then the video ends. Here we go. So what I did is I made nine new channel point sounds. These are all different alarms that you guys can play whenever there's actually a dangerous enemy nearby. So what I want you to do is if you see like a Lionel, a Bacoblin, something that actually could seriously cause issues, then I want you to play one of the alarm sounds. It's 5,000 money. I want you to play one of these, and then, so that'll let me know that there's somebody nearby. So wait, 
Wait until there's actually a guy. Just hold off until there's an enemy. Remember, there's no enemies yet. Just wait for an enemy to be there. That's all I'm asking. If there's an actual danger, then go nuts. That's great, okay? <laughs> this is fine. Let's go. Ready? I'm playing the music. We're running it. Go! <laughs> the screaming. <laughs> Wait, so the, the environment's fine now. Wait until they're... <laughs> okay, we gotta turn off Weewoo, man. Okay, there are actually enemies here. This is an appropriate time to give the Weewoo. Okay, see, this is an okay time to win. Oh, wait, he's gonna come down! 